the Solar Impulse 2 bears down on the runway at Mandalay International Airport. An excited crowd awaits touchdown on Burmese soil. Thursday saw the arrival of a truly futuristic plane, powered only by sunlight. It is an historic moment. The plane has broken and rebroken the longest journeys ever set by a solar aircraft. And the trip has put Burma on the map as a new frontier in the global push for a greener world. We can save energy with new technologies. We can make clean development. And this is not only for the environment, it's also to create jobs, to make profits, to have a better quality of life. Burmese children lined the runway to celebrate the landing. The plane set out to inspire these girls and boys who perhaps hold the key to a future of renewable energy in Burma. As this project is for everybody, and certainly for the young generation. You know, we were inspired when we were young kids, small boys. So if this airplane, if this project can inspire also other young people, that will be really fantastic. The plane is only as heavy as a family car, but has a wingspan as wide as a jumbo jet. Reaching speeds of just 100 kilometers per hour, Solar Impulse 2 will spend 25 full days in the air. The stop in Burma has come between jumps through India and China. Burma's Ministry of Electric Power is now reviewing plans for a series of major coal-fired power plants. But President Thane Sein and Army Chief Minong Lai were in Mandalay to greet the Solar Impulse 2 and her Swiss pilots will hope that Burma can emerge as a forerunner for green power in the developing world.